Hey, Doc. Mm -hmm. I was thinking tonight could be a good night for a sex night, possibly. Ooh. It's an interesting idea, but, you know, Thursdays. Stephen Laudem, how's the new opera coming along? Good, great, yes. great. We had discussed seeing a first draft of the score in two weeks. Two weeks. Is that still all right? I'm suffering from a temporary blockage at the moment. No, turn it back on. Is he all right? He had a total breakdown after his last opera. Uh -huh. I can't do this. You need to take a walk. Jolt your brain out of its little rat pattern. Interact with a stranger. Okay, honey, I have a patient. Bye. Are we going that way? I keep imagining you naked. I don't know if you want to hear more details about these images. No. But every one of these people has a story for an opera in them, Levi. What do you do? I operate a tugboat. The wrong hands, this tug is a deadly weapon. I'm addicted to romance. Isn't everybody? I've been arrested for stalking. I had to go to rehab. And uh, I'm not supposed to be doing this. Can't believe that actually happened. I mean, she seduced me, right? She's a witch. Demented tugboat captain who lures men to her tugboat and kills them and eats them. I loved it. How did you come up with that? I was really angry at you. And now it turns out I'm your muse. Do what? Oh, Steve, I'll never leave you. Um. I love cleaning. Cleanliness is close to godliness. When my patients are talking, I imagine getting inside their heads with disinfectant and just scrubbing them down. Your tugboat captain came to see me. I'm in love. No, no! Just admit that I had a magic effect on you. My imagination came up with the story. My talent wrote the music. I mean, you don't kill men and eat them, do you? <laughs> well, I haven't yet. You know I can't resist a romantic story, even if I'm not in it.